Revelio. Levioso. Anything to do with the Dark Heart should be avoided. It's too risky. Anything to do with Salazar Slytherin is worth the risk. I can't agree. And I'll not say a word more. I'm sorry. I won't give up. What were you and Omina speaking about? He's being ridiculous. Apparently Salazar Slytherin had a secret scriptorium here in Hogwarts. Omina swears it was used for the Dark Arts, so he wants nothing to do with it. I reminded him that Anne needs a cure. This scriptorium could hold the answers we need. The dark arts do pique my interest. There's more to dark magic than people realize. The Gaunts know this better than most. Perhaps I've spoken out of turn. Ominous's family history is personal to him. I'd like to know more about it if you wouldn't mind telling me. I won't repeat it. Very well. But do keep this between us. Ominous learned dark magic from his parents. Are you familiar with the Cruciatus Curse? Crucio, correct? The Cruciatus Curse, also known as the Torture Curse, inflicts excruciating pain on the victim. Apparently, his parents and older siblings had no qualms about casting it on muggles for sport. Ominous described the sound of the victim's cries as horrific, so the first time he was asked to cast it himself as a child, he couldn't bring himself to do it. As punishment, his family cast it on him. The anguish was so bad that when asked to cast it again, he relented. I have repeatedly assured Ominous that he did what he had to, but he still hasn't forgiven himself. How horrible. Poor Ominous. He was only a child. He shouldn't blame himself. After that incident, the rift between Ominous and his family only grew. That is until I came along. Every moment he isn't at Hogwarts, he's with us in Feldcroft. Ominous trusts me. And more often than not, he winds up listening to me. I'll remind him of that when I follow up about the scriptorium. Watch for my owl. I'll have news soon enough. I'll make Ominous understand. He'll change his mind. You can't imagine how incendiary it was before I invented the loop hacker. Hogsmeade, here I come.
you, Fret Biscuit. I shall sort something out. Welcome. Come on in. Now, where was I? Right. Oh, yes. <laughs> now, you let me know if there's anything else I can help you with. No one can say I don't keep a stack shelf. What will I do without her? I told you not to go down that path. I know we're not supposed to. Hello. Mind you, don't turn quick. If you're stuck with a Duracore feather, it doesn't half hurt. Hello. Oh, welcome to Brood and Peck. I'm Ellie Peck. And before you ask, I'm out of a Braxton hair. The lot of it was bought up by a trader in Ottery St. Catchpole. Made me take it in person, they did. No care that I had to shut the shop. Apparently had a bad experience with someone shipping them hair for my wampus cat. Must have been someone from America, no doubt, because we don't even have a Mia. Anyway, what are you here for? Moon car fur? Derricall feathers? Always have trouble collecting them myself as the bird keeps disappearing. Cheeky thing. <laughs> Used to carry them in the shop, Derricalls. But people kept asking for their money back when they'd get home and the blasted things would be nowhere in sight. I can imagine that would be rather frustrating. There's worse. Trust me, most of the suppliers of whopper feathers may as well be living in St Mungo's. Not surprising, I suppose, the cry in those things. Oh, but such marvellous feathers. <laughs> Almost worth going mad for. Sounds like stocking your shelves comes with some hazards. Truer words never spoken. Used to carry beasts themselves. Good business it was, but add it up to here with parents grumbling. Not my fault if the little ones caught a flea of an easel. Ooh, you should have heard them. No, <laughs> best with byproducts. And I do like to make sure the beasts are safe and well cared for. Couldn't guarantee that with some of these prospective owners. Now, why don't you have a good look around? Stocks change all the time, and not just because they disappear. Always best to pop in whenever you can to get things before they run out. <laughs> Which they used to literally do. <laughs> 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 thank you, I will. Take all the time you need. And thank you for stopping by. A treat to have you here. What do you have for sale? Now, what sorts of beast byproducts might you be looking to acquire? I'll not mind seeing you here again. Consider yourself welcome.
Does it get any more cosy than Hogsmeade? Come on inside. Oh, watch yourself. Revelio. Let's have you leave here alive. You're a force to be reckoned with, aren't you? Scaring all the goblins away. A wee bit. Hello. Oh, hello. Whew. Sorry, I'm in a bit of a tizzy. I was just scolding some of the plants for spitting and nipping. I suppose it's my own fault for putting more than four to a tray. By the way, Beatrice Green is the name, but you may address me as Madam Green. Welcome to Dogweed and Death Cap. Oh, uh, mind you, don't knock the mandrakes. Oh, if there wasn't the constant demand for antidotes, I wouldn't need to stalk so many of the little deers. Except, of course, for curses. And, well, if you've been petrified, then obviously you've come to the right place. <laughs> Mind you don't knock the mandrakes. Oh, if there's an uprooting, you'll be the next one to drop dead and I'm in no mood for a clear-up. What do you have for sale? Well, what say we show you some of what's available? Oh, I'm always thrilled when a young one makes a wise purchase. I can tell you'll go far. Doors always open. You be sure to stop by soon. Sometimes it seems all roads lead to Hogsmeade. Whiskey over here. <laughs> you have to learn to share. Assignment all finished. Expelliarmus. No! Incendio. Revelio. Confringo. Depulsor. Expelliarmus. Levioso. resource indeed, your field guide. What seems to be the problem? You may well ask. I'm convinced I saw a grim, an omen of death. I'm not safe, but 
If it can't see me, I'll be all right, won't I? All I need is an invisibility potion. Yes, that's what I need. I'm afraid I'm all out of invisibility potion. I suggest finding somewhere safe and being especially careful. Safe? Careful? Yes, that makes sense. And you're sure you don't... No. Very well. Hopefully the Grim, or whatever it has foretold, doesn't get me first. Nice to see you, my young friend. I've completed my assignments, Professor. Pleased to hear it. Professor Weasley will be too. I'll be sure to let her know how well you're coming along. Thank you, Professor. Professor Hecate tells me she taught you Levioso, so you should be ready for a more advanced levitation charm. Wingardium Leviosa requires a bit of concentration and a nice graceful wand movement. Let's see you try your hand at it. When executed correctly, you should be able to pick up boulders as though they were sprigs of sneezewort. Wingardium Leviosa? Feel free to practice Wingardium Leviosa here in the greenhouse. I've set some crates out for you in the next room. Wingardium Leviosa.
Everything's all right now. Professor Howen will never believe this. yourself. I mean you no harm.
can't imagine how inconvenient travel was before I invented flu powder. We got him, Leviosa. These rocks have seen better days. <laughs> it's been ages since I've found anything worth poaching near Crackrock. Confringo! <laughs> How would you like to learn the knockback jinx flippendo? Once you've completed the necessary tasks, come and find me in the greenhouse. Confringo! What are you, a gobstone? Expelliarmus! Where'd it go? Oh. Best you can do, Guardian Leviosa. Guardian Leviosa. Strike. Leviosa. Capulsa. You will not survive. Leviosa. Alohomora. No, you don't. Leviosa! Revelio. Who lived here, I wonder? Levioso. Capulso. Resource indeed, your field guide. I'm most pleased to be included. This could prove dangerous. Revelio. Over here, quietly. 
I am glad that you received my owl. We need to stay low and remain quiet. Lassie, what's going on? Why are we all the way out here? As promised, I did some investigating to find out what Harlow is up to. I followed him to the Hog's Head. I noticed him reading a letter. All I could see was that it was signed by and bore the seal of Victor Rookwood. And after you told me that Rookwood and Harlow were after you, I decided that you were the perfect person to join me in taking them down. For good. That letter is the tangible proof that Officer Singer needs. It is why I followed Harlow here and why I wrote to you. I need your help to retrieve it. I'll help you find the letter, Natty. I'm glad to hear it. First, we must access the castle keep. I'll check the main gate, see if you can find another way in. I do not see any guards, but we should still try to be as quiet as possible. Harlow is here after all. what that does. Devolso! That did it. Wingardium Leviosa. Wingardium Leviosa. Levioso, Akio. Akio, Wingardium Leviosa. Levioso. Revelio. I need to find a way into the gatehouse to open the gate for Natty. Revelio. Dead end. Must be another way in. Accio.
Revelio. That looks as if it might raise the gate. Do it this way. I will get the door. <laughs> that is the main keep. My guess is that we'll find Hollow and the letter inside. We'll need to be careful once we get. I hear them. Yeah, restrain the base. Yeah. Hi, Wang. Do you know that hippogriff? Get this thing back to now. Very well. New plan. I get the evidence and you free that hippogriff. Agreed? This is our chance. Go! Ugh. Blast it! There's got to be another way to get up to the roof somewhere. So thanks for watching. Don't forget to drop a like if you enjoyed this video. Also subscribe the channel for more such content and see you in the next one.